it's a term that's used in America uh, principally, and I think it's a bad term to use. Of course, figuratively, you can have a war on terror, just as you can have a war on drugs, a war on crime, or even a war on litter. But if it's meant literally, and some American spokesmen do use it in this sense, then in my view, it's wrong for two reasons. First, in Europe, we do face a very acute threat from Islamist terrorism, but the people who commit these attacks are people who live in our own countries, mostly citizens of our own countries. It's not like 9-11 where people were infiltrated from outside. So are we really saying that we're at war with our own citizens? But secondly, it's the terminology that the terrorists themselves want. Terrorists always like to make themselves important by calling themselves an army or soldiers. It was the Irish Republican Army. It was the Rote Armee Fraktion, the Red Army Fraction in Germany. And they love everything that goes with the notion of being at war, the whole paraphernalia of soldiery and so on. If you remember that chilling so-called suicide video of one of the um, July bombers in London, um, Hamid Siddiqui Khan, where he said, I'm a soldier. No, he wasn't a soldier. He was a criminal. And we should treat them as criminals.